going to discuss about how to install SQLite Studio on Windows operating system. So in Google search box right there, SQL Studio, then you can get this site, click there. So this is here for Windows operating system, click on this button and uh, there you can get here the file is now or downloading the size is 32.9 MB now or uh, thereafter here you can see or uh, there is uh, two database that I already have so I'm going to create new database this place so what exactly I'm trying to do so copying the location first opening the command prompt changing the path now I just enter there on Adams. So after that, the next is here, write SQLite 3, then give the database name. So giving here the database name test underscore db. Press enter. So now you can see this information that's come there. And uh, test db is not uh, uh, coming to that place. So write here database dot database. Then you can see here there is a database that's created test and uh, test TV and you can perform read write operation there. Now or uh, thereafter let's uh, see the status what so now this is downloaded double click on this exe file and now you need to do the uh, installation for installation click on this next wizard and uh, now this is doing the installation and uh, there icon that's created you click on this SQLite studio thereafter go to database here click on this add database so here that is just created database test db select this one and thereafter click on this ok now right click then you can this place you can create here view database add database then add it database then after create the tables so click on this create tables and uh, here you can see this place add columns so giving here id and this should be integer and let's make that primary key click on ok let's click on this another times here add columns this times giving the name and this here if you click on this drop down then you can get here text and click on this ok so when that all done then there after you can see here if you click then you can oh ok there is so uh, what exactly So a blank ok let's uh, click on this one more time add uh, table ok table name we need to add so this place giving the table name or test after that here let's click on this then you can see create table test id and name that's come there and this is how we can create the tables and after that you can apply there you can get so many tools there you can perform here see the data constant index triggers you can see these places so this is the one of the best or beautiful SQLite ID so I hope guys this video is the helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next year thank you